Hello there, everybody, and welcome to Shotgun King, the final checkmate. This is a, a new game by Punk Cake Delicious. If you don't know who Punk Cake Delicious is, uh, they are a company that essentially makes a game every month um, and then releases it. And they're always these, you know, crazy unique games. Uh, we've played a few of them in the past, um, such as uh, Ratches Den, if you remember that one. Um, so this is their next, uh, funky game that they've released, and this one is, is kind of popping off a little bit, um, in the indie scene with overwhelmingly positive reviews on Steam, uh, almost 600 reviews at the time that I'm recording this, so, um, pretty crazy stuff, this is a, a chess-based strategy roguelike, um, but it is... <laughs> I mean, it's less chess because you only have one piece, um, and that is a king with a shotgun. Um, so we're going to see how it goes. I'm, I'm expecting this is going to be interesting. Um, I don't know a lot about the game. I watched uh, SD89 play a little bit of it on Twitch the one day, but I kind of had no idea what the hell was going on, and it was background noise while I worked. <laughs> so shout out SD. Uh, but let's do this. Throne mode, get your throne back by reaching the floor 12 of the castle main tower. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Um, looks like five difficulties. I will play on normal. I'm a very good gamer. Um, Black King had been an extravagant and unpleasant ruler. As the years went by, more and more of his subjects were won over by the White King, who offered higher wages and genuinely decent work. And then they took his castle. His knights reigned from his service, even his wife, the Queen, abandoned him. How depressing. Before leaving, the last black bishop came to the black king and told him, Thou hast been a bad king, yet thine reign is still holy. Thou shalt retain a claim over thine former subject's souls, and we may yet have cause to fear thine wrath. Thus heed my warning, the wrath of a man, as godly as might thee be, is ever his undoing. This font just actually, this took all ten brain cells left inside of me to read this font. Okay. But the Black King was abandoned by all, with not a rook left to his name. All he had left was his prized royal shotgun, the shreds of his dignity, and the growing fires of the prophesied wrath. Ever my undoing was it? Undone! Just what more exactly could I lose? In his dark folly, the King loaded the shotgun and went to meet his final checkmate. I enjoyed that way too much, I'm gonna tell you. Okay, so here we are. Here we are. So this is me. <laughs> this is me. Um, so this is, I believe, our shotgun currently, right? So we have a power of four, um, range of three to five. So if we shot right now, we would not hit these guys because it appears that our range kind of kind of like taps out right here, right? And then our F arc is 57 degrees. Uh, so we want to get closer. When their pieces jiggle... That means they are moving, um, and they move like chess pieces, right? So this knight is probably going to move here, if I'm just being realistic, right? Uh, horsey moves in an L. Uh, bishop is going to come on this diagonal, probably go right here. So I don't want to go here. I think I just go up. Okay, so they did pretty much exactly what I would have expected them to do. Um, now, the pawn's going to move up to here. Pawns move twice on the first. Look, I'm not going to explain chess. The game's been around for like uh, 8 million years, okay? Okay, never. he didn't even do <laughs> necessarily what I expected him to. Okay, I am going to go... The, the king's going to move. And the rook is probably going to move to the open open file. That's fair. Um, Put me... I can't go here because the bishop covers it. Put me right here. Knight moves. I'm going to tell you. It's time to shoot, baby. So, I don't know how the gun works. I'm just going to shoot my gun. Okay. I have killed you. It looks like I have six shots, seven shots total that I can take. Click to load a shell in your shotgun. Uh, okay. So this might be the ammo I have, but I still have to click to load, and that probably takes a turn to do that. Okay. Fair enough. Soul, knight soul, use it to move like a knight. Okay. So hear me out, okay? Hear me out. These two are moving. If I go here, the logical step is for him to put me in check, probably. Him moving here. You know, he goes here, he goes here. I'm in check. I can't move here. I would have to move to here. This same thing kind of happens if you go the other way around, but it's significantly better for me. 
Because then I just move up. So I... That's not what I expected you to do. Okay. None of you are moving. Oh, I also loaded another shell. I don't know how that works. <laughs> I don't know how that works. There's no tutorial in this game, so I'm kind of... I'm freeballing it right now. Um, just shoot, right? Just shoot. Now, all of you are moving. I'm gonna be honest. Just shoot? Okay. I am in check to this rook. I will move to here. Okay, when you move, it reloads your shotgun. Okay, I am just not concerned about that. I will just destroy the king. I move. I shoot. Okay, this is easy. This is easy. I'm overthinking this. I'm playing this like it's a damn chess game. I gotta just freaking go. Um, okay, so this is... This is what happens at the end of each round. Um, and these are basically effects. The left side is, is positive, the right side is negative. Um, but you have to take a positive and negative every time. So this one, play an extra turn when you kill a knight. And it decreases our fire arc, which is good, right? You don't want it to be too high. Um, Conclave, you add two bishops as a start of turn 20. I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't... I don't think I care. An extra turn when we kill a knight, we, we, we'll just focus knights, right? We also have the the note. <laughs> Maybe the moat. The moat makes so much more sense. Non-knight pieces can't cross the moat in one move. Okay. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Last I checked, there's no moat in chess. Um, I don't know what that means. And then they also would get the secret air that adds a pawn, and then one pawn is the secret air, and the air replaces the king if he dies. It just, like, give me give me the courteous jousting. Um, and then we're going to focus fire on trying to get this, this knight. Well, we're going to try to focus fire on killing that knight, right? So, people are moving hot and heavy already. This is just a super safe spot for me. Um, never mind. You put me in check. That makes sense. Yeah. That definitely makes sense. Um, so I can't... Since I'm in check, I can't shoot, right? No. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Move me to here, right? And then I'm just going to take a big shot, and then I get an extra turn. Okay. So then the logical thing to do is to just move closer to this bishop... You get completely destroyed. Um, we move to here. Yeah, you cover. That, that's that's extremely fair. That's extremely fair. This is not a great shot. Um, yeah, I mean, that was not necessarily very good. I have to move. You put me in check. That That's fine. I fire, you're dead. Okay. Honestly, not too bad. Let, let's... I think normal mode may be a little bit too easy for me, but let's be fair. Um, I can't go higher than normal to start, so we, we got to just go for it. Um, Non-king pieces can't come near your king. Non-king pieces can't come near your king. Okay. Um, remove a rook, add five pawns, and all pawns get plus one HP. I'm going to be honest with you. I know this is the negative. This actually sounds great. To me like all all bits of this sound great plus one ammo regen plus one fire range remove two pawns add a bishop double the fire arc for one bullet no you know what that seems bad give me this so non-king pieces can't come near your king i'm i'm struggling to know that's a lot of pawns dude um i'm struggling to understand what can't come near your king means but I suppose that's fine. You cannot put me in check. There is no location you can go to put me in check. I can't go here because that would that would put me in check right now, actually. Um, okay. Put me... Put me here, right? Put me here. And then... I, I mean... I suppose you just try to kill these guys. That did not put me in check. I do have to move. This is this is a little strange, I gotta say. These pawns do have me in a little bit of a, a pickle. Okay, then you do this, you get an extra turn. I'm going to sneak up to here. 
So I'm assuming, I'm assuming that the soul, defeat a noble opponent to steal their soul. Okay, so now I have a soul of the bishop. And this king is just like extraordinarily screwed. Okay, that's, that's good. That's good. I'm assuming the pawns can promote, right? And that's kind of the danger with the pawns. Otherwise pawns are like, who cares, right? So plus one firepower, fire arc minus 18%. Dude, that seems crazy. Flip card if a piece is adjacent to you. What? What the hell does that mean? Um, and then homecoming, you can't escape her. Add a queen. And this one, she's everywhere. Add a queen. Okay. I think I, I mean, I have to take a queen. So which one of these do I like more? More firepower, but increase my fire arc. I love the idea of having like a, a slug shotgun, dude. <laughs> <laughs> where we just have this strong thing but then it's a short little narrow arc so all the bullets are hitting that seems like really good to me i love this choice system dude it's the positive negative you know i talk about how, how roguelites every good roguelite has choices right this definitely remains true um for a game like this right having Having all of the choices in the game make it really interesting. And as a lover of chess, I mean, this is a, a fascinating little game. Uh, so this is actually really interesting. This king, right, um, is going to be forced to move here. So here's my play. Put me here. The king has to move there. And then I can't believe that your pawns freaking saved your ass. Like, that makes me real mad. I'm in check. Fair enough. I kill... I don't kill your knight. Are you kidding me? I kill your knight. Okay. Then that gives me an extra turn. This is not actually super good, though. Um, so just slug me. Holy crap, we just rolled right through you. Let's just move simply once. That queen does not bother me. I will annihilate... Fair enough. I understand. I will annihilate your king. Thank you very much. This is fine, and I love our, our fire arc being so low. That is cool to me. Very cool. Okay, so plus two firepower. I love this. Flip the card if your king is not on the board's edge. I don't know what the frick that means, for the record. Like, I really have no clue what that means. Um, and then our pawns are pikemen. They can attack on the first two squares in front of them. That's definitely a change. Um, adding a rook, gain two ammo each time you kill a rook. We already got rid of a rook, so this seems bad. So I'm going to take this, but I don't know what this means. Flip card if your king... <laughs> Hit me with this again. Oh my god, they're little pikemen. Flip card if your king is not on the board's edge. So when I move here, this flips. This card is exhausted because your king is not on the board's edge. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. So... I I get it. Um, it's like a temporary buff, right? It's a temporary buff. Smack you. You've got me in a mating net. <laughs> That's not necessarily a, a positive thing. I will kill your knight. I get an extra turn. I will kill... I'll, I'll just shoot at your king, to be honest with you. as, as a good amount of damage to your king. Um, I will... Where's your king gonna go? I'm going to soul of the knight to here. Pardon me? Um, I'm... I made it? <laughs> yeah. I'm made it. Okay. Queen covers this. King is on top of me. I cannot do six damage to the king. Um, I'm, I'm made it. I made it. You, you know what? You got me. Um, I suppose you, you try to shoot the pawn, but then in some planet, the king captures me. Okay. Uh, you know what? I got cocky. I got cocky. I would like to try again. We, we have this on lock now, though. We have this on lock. I, I played a little loosey-goosey. I played a little fast. Um, I should have I should have not played so fast. It was, it was a, a righteous mistake, all things considered. Um, I'm just, I'm just climbing into the back ranks, dude. What the hell are we doing? I would like this soul of the night. Um, I would like to take a shot at the king. Fair enough. You cover. That's true. Fair enough. You're right there. I understand. I would like to soul of the night to here. 
I would like to destroy the bishop. I would like to destroy the king. I would like to move to here. Yeah, I understand. You cover. You're dead. Okay. I like, you know, if, if on these early ones, dude, having a soul, you know, sitting in our back pocket, kind of important. Right click to throw a grenade. <laughs> okay. Um, we remove a pawn. We add a knight. We decrease our ammo max. I, I have to know, right? I have to know. All pieces minus one speed is interesting. Adding two knights, a bishop, and a rook is, is horrible. But a wand that deals eight damage on random enemies. J give me the holy hand grenade, dude. This seems amazing. So, like, hear me out, right? Hear me out. I move to here. And then I... Chuck a grenade. This is the sickest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay. And then I just, like, shoot you. And then you're just dead. <laughs> okay. Um, that's wild. That's really wild. Charge an additional shell in your royal shotgun. Fire arc plus 7%. Plus one ammo max. 50% chance to knock back an enemy. Dude, I'm gonna tell you. Hit me with the extra barrel in my gun. I didn't even see what the negative was. Oh no, what have I done? What have I done? There's an extra rook. Add two pawns and add a rook, but the rooks have less HP. I, I don't really care. That's fine. That's fine. Go here. You guys are nice and happy. I'm I'm chill with this. I kill you. Um, I'll just go here, I think. I mean, I'll kill you too. I'll kill you too. I still got more more bullets in my uh, my situation here. So I love this play, and then I love just basically tossing a grenade up here. How? I'm I'm dead. I'm dead unless every bullet hits right here, because I'm I'm in check. I can't get out of check. I can't believe it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who said he was bad? Who said he was bad when he just almost got checkmated? Okay, um, Sacred Crown, you can play an extra turn after using a soul card. That seems ridiculously good. I mean, that seems actually just insanely good. Um, plus one firepower, also good. But no, this seems great. So it seems like you always get the queen on turn three. This is a lot of pieces, dude. That's a lot of pieces. I, I feel like we need to, uh, we need to be intelligent here. I'm in check. Fair enough. You know what? I understand. I'm still in check. Fair enough. I will kill your knight. So I can do something like this as covered. Yeah, that's, that's like extremely fair. That's extremely fair. Just kill the knight. And then let's move here. Queen is coming and, and she ain't happy. Hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna soul the knight out of here, dude. I think this is a little bit messy in our, our current situation. I also, I'm gonna tell you, it's the holy hand grenade. I'm chucking him. I, I think I think this is actually fantastic for me. I'm going to move to here. This is fine. I'm going to soul of the bishop to here and gain an extra turn. And I'm gonna move to here and then this dude is so dead. This dude's so dead. Okay. It's the value of the soul, baby. It's the value of the soul. You gotta love it. Deal eight damage to random enemies. You add a bishop, and bishops can move orthogonally. All right. That breaks the rules of chess. <laughs> okay, Wand of Wrath. Deal firepower damage to a non-king target. So our, we would deal four damage to anyone. We remove a bishop and add six pawns. Dude, there's, there's too many pawns. This is too many. Add me a bishop. We get the wand of, of downpour. Is that what that said? This is too many pieces. I'm, I'm just a lowly king. The wand of downpour, you deal eight damage to random enemies. I just feel like, I, I mean, I feel like our play, right, is get in here. Then chuck a grenade. That is a horrible spot. Just kidding. It was insane. <laughs> it was the best spot ever. Okay, then I will use the wand to frick up enemies. And then, are you ready for this? Right? Are you ready for this? We go here. That uh, You're covered. Fair enough. You go here. I get an extra turn. I hit this. Then you go here. That's covered. Then you go here. 
you get an extra turn. You kill him. Then you go here, you get an extra turn, and then you just kill the king. I'm animating that. You got four health. I move. I'm going to chuck a grenade. No, I'm going to shoot the king. What does more damage, the grenade or the king? Or the grenade or the gun, not the king. I mean, I'm dead, right? So, toss a grenade. I'm dead to the queen. The grenade didn't go off. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. You got me. You got me. Um, try again. We, 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 I'm not sure we were playing correctly. Yeah, that's fair. You cover me. That's fair. You're still covering that same spot. <laughs> it makes, it makes a, a whole buttload of sense. Okay, give me this. Just bring me up to here. I would love to kill this rook. I really would. I would really like to kill the rook. Um... What have I done? I'm I'm literally mated. I'm literally mated. I'm so lucky. I'm actually the luckiest person alive. Okay. Um. Yeah. I would argue let's not do that ever again. Play an extra turn after using a soul card. I still think this is crazy. Add a pawn every four turns. <laughs> it seems like absolutely horrible. But I mean that's part of the fun, right? So we'll 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 roll it. We'll roll it. I think we bum rush. If you get a soul, right? Um then just freaking send it, right? Like, what What are you going to do to stop me at this point? I go here. You add a pawn. It's, it's hilarious. It really is. I go here. Fair enough. You, you have put me into a position that I am a little bit screwed. Just take a shot at the king. Move to here. Very fair. Honestly, extremely fair move. Uh, I would like to move to here. I shoot your rook. I kill your rook. You don't have the firepower to defeat me. You only have pawns that are moving one at a time. I'm not sweating that. I'm not sweating that in any way. So the, the note, we could take the note. Ooh, dude, wait a minute. Bullets pierce, but minus firepower and minus range. This is a horrible idea, but piercing shotgun, I love the idea of. So I'm going to do it. But I want you to know I don't think it's good. Okay? I'm freaking sending it. I'm sending it. And then I'm I'm piercing. Okay? I move. I pierce. You still have a good chunk of health. Um, Hear me out, though. Give me my extra turn. Kill him. Yeah, very fair. You're, you're on top of me. Beautiful. The pikeman attacks. Yeah, that's extremely fair. That's extremely fair. The pikeman attacks. So I can move here, though, because the... The pikeman's still attacking. <laughs> He's still attacking. I'm, I'm dumb. So that... Yeah, that's covered. And that's covered. I'm mated. <laughs> Come on, dude. I'm out of bullets. I'm literally mated. I, I can't... I can't move. Okay. I'm gonna be real with you. Probably the worst one yet. Probably the worst one yet. This game is is sneaky. It's a sneaky game. At the beginning, I played it like chess, right? And then I realized this ain't chess. I don't need to play methodical and sneaky. Absolutely not. I can just, you know, full send. It's an action thriller. But what have I learned? I've learned that it's the exact opposite. You have to play it like chess. You have to play it like chess. And because the game is is a sneaky, sneaky little strategic masterpiece. There's a reason this is getting insane reviews. And it's because the game is extremely, extremely smart. Right? Queen plus 1 HP, King plus 2 HP. We charge an additional shell on our shotgun. I'm not really worried about that, but I'm not really worried about this either. I guess I will do this. Um, the additional shell, I'm I'm just not not necessarily concerned about that. But but that's okay. I was in check. I'm I'm not sweating it. 
I feel like these early moves, dude, is all about creating space for yourself, right? Get some space, get some shots in. I mean, this is just, how the hell are you alive? If I'm just being like perfectly honest with you, how the hell did you stay alive that entire time? With this much firepower, we can afford to get a little crazy. I think you take this for sure. Remove a bishop, but you add a queen at the start of turn 10. It's spicy, but the increased fire range with this many bullets, we could get a little, we could get a little, uh, little crazy, right? I think that, I think it's good. I need to know where this king moves. I love it. You cover that spot. Okay, that's fine. Kill the knight. Oh, I'm so clean. I'm so clean until the king just decides like, hey, what's up? I'm gonna stand next to you. I'm surrounded by pieces. Okay. <laughs> when you just spawn a queen on turn 10 right next to me, that's, that's fun for sure. King minus one HP. You can jump over a nearby piece, dealing one damage to it. That seems extremely good. And we have to take a queen anyway. I'm not worried about the ammo, Max. Like, I, I got ammo out the ass. That, that's not a problem for me. Okay. So welcome the queen to the party. She's going to be annoying, for sure. Our range is so good, dude, that I might as well, you know, get a little crazy here. Don't don't use the, the soul of the, uh, the thingy right now. Now, can we get better position here? No, I think you just chill. I think you take a damn shot. I, I think you probably kill her here. But you know what? You could kill her next time, right? So take a wide arcing shot there. Then we're going to do a little... This is messier than I originally expected. We're going to move to here. Queen back up. Blech. Kill her. Now I would like to get the heck out of here. You're going to do some whack stuff. Dude, this is, this is a little messier than what we signed on for. If this was a normal game of chess, I would be peeing my pants right now. Okay, move me to here. Ah, uh, dude, I don't have any ammo. How do I get ammo? <laughs> okay, I have to use this. We get ammo by moving. Okay. Just move. Shoot. It's a little spicy. Little spicy, but you know what? You get the job done. Okay, I understand the ammo max all of a sudden. Very much so understand. I'm taking the damn blunderbuss. Adds a pawn, and pawns can move in four directions. What? How the hell does that work, dude? Pawns got an upgrade. <laughs> we have 94% fire arc. Um, What is this looking like? Oh my lord, dude. Okay, that's that's really bad. That is extremely bad. This is also not exactly great. I would like to... Yeah, that's like definitely fair. I would like to do this. And then I would like to kill this knight. Okay. Then I would like to just give me a wide arcing hell. I I hate this. Um, But actually, unironically, I kind of love it. Because what if I just kill this? It's like not where I wanted a queen to just show up and have a good time right now. I I definitely did not want that. I'm dead. I'm actually dead. I mean I'm I'm actually dead yet again. I'm I'm covered in all directions. I'm I'm in a damn mating net yet again. And I have no bullets. And the soul of the night cannot save me today. I'm mated by the queen. Okay. <laughs> okay. You know what? One final try. One final try. You 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 are intriguing me, you little shotgun king. Very, very smart game. Um that is covered. That is true. You know what? Take a shot. Give me that soul of the night. I would like to slip right up to here. This what a horrific move by me. I mean just actually a god awful move. Um Everything I've done at the beginning of this fight has been a horrifically bad move. Yes, that is covered. You're, you're, you could not be more correct. It was a very, very covered shot. 
What if I just cleared the entire board, huh? Like, what, what if I clear the whole damn board? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna chase me down? What's your problem, huh? Get out. Okay. Non-night pieces. You know what? You gotta, you gotta try, you gotta try the note. You gotta try the, the note with an M. Okay, I understand. <laughs> so the moat just sits in the middle. Non-night pieces can't cross the moat in one move. That includes me. Okay. I'm gonna tell you, I, I don't really get it. Okay? I don't really get it. I feel like this is more of a negative for me than a positive. But maybe I'm not understanding positives and negatives. Yeah, fair enough. Maybe I'm not understanding positives and negatives. I don't know. Is I guess it's fine for right now. We'll run the damn moat. Play an extra turn when you kill a knight. I do think that's good. Once per floor, lift a non-king piece on your path without ending your turn. What the frick does that mean? I do think this is good. All pieces minus one speed. This adds so many pieces, dude. You you have to do this. I'm sorry. That that one just seems so bad. The minus speed, sure, but it seems so bad to add that many pieces. Like what what are we gonna do with that many pieces, man? Get killed. I take an extra turn. I'm gonna get a little sicko. I'm gonna get a little sicko. Put me right here. Then you go here. I felt so good about that play, dude. And then all of a sudden, I'm looking like a damn fool with my pants on the ground. I can't kill you. I have to take a shot at you, my friend. Thank God. Because that could have been um, disastrous. I'm freaking dead again. No. I will I will soul of the knight or soul of the rook out of here. And then I will move to here. Give me my sp give me the soul of the bishop back. I don't mind. I don't mind. Okay, we did not play that intelligently though. So don't do that ever again. Play an extra turn after using a soul card. Yes. That is good as well. We do have to upgrade our gun <laughs> at some point in time. If we don't upgrade the gun, we're going to be in we're going to be in rough shape, okay? We're going to be in rough shape. Just move me forward. This is where I'm like, I don't know, do you take a shot? I don't think you do. You know what? I like this. Kill the knight. I get an extra turn. Move. No, just take a shot right here. I'm out of bullets. Move to here. Kill the bishop. Every time I say kill the bishop, all I can think about is the stupid TV show Hawkeye. Um, move here. Kill the rook. This is great. I'm, I'm extremely... There's a damn queen? Where the hell did the queen come from? Yeah, that's right. We added a queen a couple seconds ago. Okay. I would like to kill... I just missed every shot. I missed every shot. Oh, the queen can't mate me across the moat. Hold on. That's a game changer? That's an actual literal game changer. Dude, I have so much confidence. I have so much confidence. Thank you so much. She actually can't mate me across the moat. That is so insane. That's such an insane idea. Okay. Thank you. Kill. I'm mated by the damn king. Okay. Don't ever do that ever again. Okay. The moat is cracked. The moat is actually cracked. I think we, we have created something here. Add an extra soul slot. What? You, yes like absolutely yes now we can carry two and we can do like whack job combos okay i think this is i think this is beyond good i think it is insanely insanely good i made it by the queen on a discovered mate because i'm on the moat okay <laughs> you know what fair enough um you got me i was not even paying an ounce of attention to the fact that a queen was covering the file that I was uh, shooting down. Dude, Shotgun King, what a fascinating little game. Um, definitely recommend checking this out. Uh, I'll have a link to it in the description down below. It's only $6, uh, so if you want to see kind of what's going on, um, go check it out. They also do plan on doing some uh, 
some future plans for the game. They got some updates coming, um, reworking the game's uh, difficulties, and they're also adding uh, mod support to the game, which is kind of cool. So I'm sure that could make it interesting in the long run. Uh, but yeah, I mean, really fascinating little game. I'm happy to play some more if you guys enjoy. So uh, leave a like on the video, and uh, maybe I'll see you guys back in the uh, on the chessboard for a future future shotgun king opportunity thanks so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next one have a good rest of your day bye bye